Henry, you mentioned um, flooding earlier on, and I lived in the Netherlands some years ago, and parking underground parking garages were actually used to store water during flood events. So they, they, they became a facility to store water. But here they can be something of a liability. Um, as you said, what is the impact of parking more generally on climate change and on cities' ability to respond to the effects of climate change? Well, I think parking has a negative impact uh, in terms of our contribution to climate change in a few ways. Um, the first and most obvious one is that parking is a massive subsidy for driving. The more parking you provide, the more people will drive. And driving, transportation, is America's largest source of greenhouse gas emissions. So parking is part and parcel of the policies, the, the, the suite of policy choices that we've made that make driving absolutely essential in this country. And that is, of course, a major con contributor to climate change. In terms of our ability to adapt, parking is also um, stopping us from doing some of the things we need to do. Uh, you mentioned garages holding water. The reason garages are good at holding water is not just because they're underground, but also because um, they're uh, impervious, right? I mean, they just, they fill up and they contain water rather than uh, leaking it back into the ground. And that, that actually in most places is a problem, mm. either because you end up with a situation like what they have in Houston or Chicago, where you have these uh, pretty densely built, highly paved neighborhoods where people's basement floods every time it rains because there's so much impervious surface that the water doesn't go into the ground. Now, but the other reason is that in dry parts of the country, like Los Angeles, Every time it does rain, that water doesn't get into the ground and penetrate into aquifers where it could replenish the drinking water supply. So that's that's a major problem as well. Um, and then finally, of course, all this asphalt is an enormous contributor to the urban heat island effect. So in terms of weathering the effects of climate change, whether it's rain or heat, um, we have built ourselves into an environment uh, that is not doing us any favors.